Okay, so welcome to the war recap of uh, Monkey Land against Team Treater. Traitor? Let's say Traitor, sounds better. Um, so here's a look at what they, obviously not that close to war, uh, 41 to 30 in our favour. Let's have a look at what they did to our bases, mainly two stars, uh, a few three stars in the middle, but failed to clean up. Our lower bases, uh, including little Scrappy, my premature turn all nine account, um, premature on on defense, trying to max offense and keep him at the bottom of the map. Um, I guess he's uh, more like a turn all seven with some turn hall nine features. I'll show you the base. So um, pretty premature. I mean, we've got level seven. Uh, Town Hall 7 level wizard towers and only two of them um, Only two mortars as well. They really add weight to the map splash damage Don't actually do that much either um, Four ADs Queen in the middle four giant bombs uh, And I've now got only three touches on this but four now um, and It poses quite a problem I think Opposing clans don't really know what to do with him. Do they send the bottom guy against him when they do? It generally fails. Uh, you can see here they sent their top turn all eight down. Uh, he only one starred it. Um, some clans sent a turn all nine down, and, and so far that's failed as well. So even though he's premature on defense, I'm not worried about it. It's, the base is holding up. It's not been three starred yet as a uh, in quotes turn all nine. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty happy with um, with how he's holding up. Let's have a look at what we did to them. <clears throat> and as you can see, we straight wrecked them. Just missed a two off the top base, but other two tunnel tens are two starred. Then all the nines and all the eights three starred. Um, some great performances this war. Uh, we'll go through some of those attacks. I'm um, just going to start by showing you one of my attacks just to make the point that uh, although my base is the bottom of the map defensively, offensively, uh, sorry about that, let's get back. Offensively, he's a uh, you know decent ish Town Hall 9, certainly for attacking Town Hall 8s. Um, he's got the Queen. Uh, this attack, I only think I had one extra of the army camps done. But as you can see, I wrecked this base in 1 minute 43. Um, CC's done, so I've got a max level golem, which helps massively. I'm tucking into the king, making the funnel with the wizards. My baby king down to take out his king whilst the wall breakers come in. Um, CC comes out. Poison down and jump into the core. Late Queen. Hopefully she's not going to wrap around. There's the jump. Look at that baby level 3 Queen. Yeah, she does wrap around. Doesn't actually end up hurting me. Here come the hogs from the left. And I think, I, I forgot to look, I think I had about 30 hogs with the extra troop space. Um, four heal, uh, three heals as well as the jump. Heal in the core. There's double giant bombs here. Yeah, takes out a few hogs, but not the main pack. Uh, backup hogs coming in from the left. Final heal goes down. Uh, this base is nearly done. Queen's wrapping around the bottom. Last defense down. Let's just clean up now. Start to fast forward. Yeah, so I mean, really, there's no excuse for me failing on a tunnel late now, uh, as I did uh, in the war we've, we've currently having. Um, the only real way I can fail is not killing the CC, not killing the drag, which is exactly what happened this war. And the drag just ended up chasing my my hogs around, which was uh, which was very frustrating. But there we go. It happens sometimes. Right, let's show some other people's attacks. Um, who have we got next? Just and Justin. Um, this guy, absolute beast. Another six star war for him. 
um, the two top tunnel nines. This guy just doesn't fail. He, he, he depresses me how good he is. Um, this was a hog attack. I think we're going to show this one, which is a Laloon attack. Um, just the way he deploys troops, so patient. Um, it really pays off. So two golems into the hero compartment. Look at those heroes, 25, 29. Jealous of those as well. King's ability used. Jump down. CC taken care of. Yep, job done for the first part. Has he taken any ADs? All four ADs still up. So with two golems, you really want to be trying to target two ADs. He hasn't actually got any. This is what frustrates me about him. He's not got any ADs and he's still three stars. Um, in comes the Hound, just four or five lanes into that compartment. King is going to pick up an AD here. Second Hound in from the south. Very patient on that Rage. It makes the Teslas less of an issue. In come the back end lanes. Still got still got two hounds up. I mean they're they're lower level ADs, it's not a max base, but Oh, he used the Queen's Queen's ability there. He must have been a raid he used on the kill squad before. I don't like those core Teslas. I mean they're, they're the death of me with Lion attacks. Core cool Teslas just rinse my loons, but not for this guy. Last defense going down. Loads of lava pups cleaning up. Queen's still doing business around the outside. Still got a rage left. Still got a spell left. I don't know what to say about that. Is he going to use it? I'd dump it in the middle. Swag rage in the middle. I think he's too tight on elixir to do that. <laughs> Although, judging by his base at the minute where he's left all of his elixir and gold out, I don't think he needs it. I would have put a swag rage in the middle there just to show off a bit. Uh, but there we go. Six star war for Justin. Absolutely brilliant performance, as always. Uh, hating, hating. Um, another guy who had a six-star war, Mr. Awesome. Uh, let's have a look at him attacking the top down all eight. Which obviously pissed, uh, pissed Knack off. Doesn't like people attacking that. Um, let's have a watch of this, because he actually, bring, he actually brings the wrong spells to this attack. Um, it's a Valg attack, and I think he meant to bring more more heals. Um, but kind of, I don't really know how, but it ends up working out. So one hog in to get the lure, trigger the CC, dragging them over to the Fire Builder Hut. What's he going to use to kill them? Okay, got them down. Is he saving the poison for the skellies? I prefer to use it on the on the on the CC to be honest. Using poison on skellies now is is a bit. I oh, has used it. Okay, yeah, he's not really using hog, so yeah, that makes sense. Um, drags down anyway. Loon's about to go down. There we go. So King. In come the Valks. Wide enough funnel. We've got to be really careful using Valks. Um, to make sure they funnel right. Rage down. I think he wanted more heals. Uh, I think I remember him saying when he did the attack he brought the wrong spells, but Valks are in the core, heal on them. Hogs come in, that's good. Hogs come in as their defences are distracted, that's nice. Valks tearing up the core. And Hogs doing some work on the outside. I think he's got all his Valks still up. Yeah, I think he wanted another heal there on the Rage, but I mean, Rage does work on Valks. I mean, Valks are kind of like hogs. You, you really just want to heal them and keep them alive. You know, they, they, they don't need the increased damage from a Rage. Um, and they're pretty pretty quick anyway. So, yeah, I think he definitely meant to bring heals. More hogs. Well, they're the same hogs. I think they're, they're CC hogs. Yeah, CC hogs. Um, to pick up these, these last defenses. Hogs are kind of running all over the base. He's kind of lucky in terms of bombs. Or as I say, that one goes off. Uh, 
Has he got enough juice to get this last Tesla with a whiz? Yep. There we go. Now let's just clean up. Kind of, kind of a bit lucky in that he brought the wrong spells, but still a great attack. Um, yeah, six star ball from him as well. Uh, we'll finish off by looking at a guy who actually had a 12 star war. He's got two accounts in the clan Omni and Ominous. Um, you know, 12 star war, not bad. We'll have a look at um, one of his hog attacks. I, would, I did want to show a drag attack, but the drag attacks were both on town or sevens. One was a town or eight with. I only had two ADs, so it's kind of like a 7.5. It's not really worth showing. Uh, which is actually, you know, this base has got three ADs. Um, so, yeah, uh, standard CC trigger. Drag them over. I've got to get better at killing the CCs. These dragons and the CCs are the bane of my life. Uh, you, you've got to invest enough to kill them because if you don't kill them, particularly with hogs, you might as well just quit there and then. Um, yeah, golem down. I don't. I don't mind that. Um, it does the golem does get? You no, know, it's got absolutely hammered there. It's kind of a you know, it's a big investment to use the golem to distract the dragon. You know, golem's thirty troop space. You know, I prefer to do it with a, a couple of barbs to distract and then wizards, but again, I, I've screwed that up enough times. Anyway, um, he's going in. Hog started from the backside, immediately hit a bomb, healed them back up though. It's a double bomb there. Kind of got away with that. I oh, know it's only a single, apologies. I just put all his hogs in at once. Um, which I'm not a massive fan of. It's always good to try and keep some for for the backside, unless it's a really compact base, which I guess this kind of is. Where all the defenses are are close. Uh, it's got one hill left. Yeah, good spot to put it. It's clearly a spring trap there, which he's avoided, has he? No. Oh, there's no spring trap there. Hole in the wall, but no trap. Uh, poison down. I think to to pick up the skellies, which didn't work. Or did it? Yeah, they're here skellies. I'm tired, man. I've only just got back from from abroad. But yeah, uh, you know, great attack. Uh, King's still up, which is working on the town hall. Clean up going on all over the place, and twelve star war. Yeah, everyone performed well this war. Um, some some really good attacks. Uh, they didn't have the best bases, but we can only we can only fight what we're up against. So. And there we go. Another victory for Monkeyland.